here at the Aspen Ideas Health Festival. The secret sauce of innovation is this sort of cross-pollination that can occur, right? So someone comes up with an idea in a particular field and then we're, con you know, I'm like, oh, that's, that's a really good idea. Maybe it will work in, you know, what I do. And we think about that all the time. I think, you know, the one thing that we discussed and I think came out was how much optimism people should have for the future of medicine. And, you know, I think it's, if it's not obvious already, it should be that, you know, what we did in terms of developing the, the vaccines uh, shows, you know, what science, what science can do. And, and, you know, as we discussed at the panel, the 10 year horizon is extremely optimistic for our ability to treat, you know, new pathogens, but also to treat diseases like cancer and depression. And, you know, I think the research that we're doing at Mount Sinai is, is, is really at the forefront of pushing the boundaries of the next set of diseases that we're going to be able to treat. We are at vaccine, you know, mRNA therapeutics generation one, and we're working on generation two or generation three. And the idea is, you know, right now, what the mRNA vaccines and, and other RNA and DNA therapeutics are really good at is stimulating the immune system. But one, we don't know, are they optimally stimul stimulating the immune system? So can we make them even better? And can we do the opposite? Can we use them to teach the immune system to turn off? So in autoimmune disease, we have too much of an immune response. And can we educate the immune system using these therapeutics to turn off the immune system to say, stand down? And the way we're trying to do that is by targeting these therapeutics. So we're building into these mRNA therapeutics ways of making them only be active in cell types that will turn off the immune system or, and that will help for autoimmune disease, inflammatory disease. But can we also maybe even target them to cell types that will turn on the immune system in an even better way than our current generation of mRNA vaccines and therapeutics.